a big star. She's in uh, the movie The Dry Land, which is in theatres July the 30th. Please welcome the adorable, the sexy, my friend America Ferrara, everybody. Uh, yeah. Look at you, you look fantastic. You're all. <laughs> you look amazing. Oh, thank you. I'm feeling very. <laughs> How are you? I haven't seen you since the How to Train Your Dragon thing. I the... know. Yeah, but you did a great job in that movie. You were amazing. People thought in that you movie. were Jerry Butler, but you were. You were you. <laughs> you were amazing. No, no, you, you were amazing. <laughs> no, you Good night, everybody. <laughs> That's the kind of the conversations See? that would go on in celebrity jail. <laughs> you were amazing. How are you? You all right? I'm good. I'm busy running busy? around. What are you doing? Yeah. Well, just traveling. We've been everywhere. I went to Iraq in June. Wow, really? That's yeah. an interesting holiday choice. Yeah. <laughs> were you on a USO tour? I was. Good for you. You do USO. Yes, I yeah. do. Yeah, yeah. I love the USO. I mean, the troops keep saying, please send us someone entertaining. <laughs> I'm like, no. <laughs> you have to know what's going on at home. And here I am. Mediocrity is still there in America waiting for you <laughs> when you come back. And then we went to Scotland. You did not. Yes. Really? We went to your homeland. Yeah. Well, this is my homeland now. Oh, I enjoy, that? yes, I enjoy California privileges. <laughs> Where did you go? Why were you in Scotland? Because uh, for the Edinburgh Film Festival. Oh, you took your movie with there. With the dry land. Oh. And we actually, we won the um, Best International Feature Award at, at Edinburgh. Congratulations. Thank that is a very you. prestigious award. And... The Edinburgh Film Festival, to be fair, is a, is a very big deal. That's it's like, a big deal. That's, it was awesome. Yeah. It was really cool. Did and you travel around and see any medieval torture sites? We, we, were, we got to go to the castle. Edinburgh Castle. Many people were tortured to death there. <laughs> Went down in the um, like the cave, the caves. Yeah, well, yes, uh, the the, uh, ba the uh, basement. Uh, the, what do they call them? Dungeons, dungeons. Yes. Right, or because take him to the basement. <laughs> do you mean the dungeon, sir? <laughs> yes, the dungeon. Take him to the dungeon. Because the basement is where we've got the foosball table. Yes, all right. Take him, take him to the dungeon then. <laughs> Because the city was built on top. I'm just going to ignore that. No, no, I know. You're right. Because the city was like built on top of itself a hundred times, right? Yeah, yeah. So they I, would. Yeah, yeah. Sorry, go so, on, yeah. No, no, it's not that interesting, I guess. No, it is. <laughs> It's, um, anyway, there were ghosts down there and all that Did sort of stuff. Did you see a ghost? No, we didn't get to see a ghost. They said that, uh, like, psychics go there a lot from around the world to feel the spirits. Right. And that this one woman from Japan sensed, <laughs> <laughs> sensed a, a five-year-old girl's spirit who uh -oh. was still there and upset because she had lost her bear. And right. so then people from all around the world sent her stuffed teddy bears. And, and the, so you the, walk into this really dark dungeon room and there's just a mound of stuffed teddy bears. <laughs> it's like the creepy, it's very yeah, it's creepy. creepy. <laughs> That's actually the very reason I left. <laughs> I was like, please don't make me back to the teddy bear room. I don't want to go to, can I go to America instead? Fine, go to America. <laughs> No, I, I, uh, I, I like Edinburgh. It's a very, uh, it's very, beautiful. very lovely we town. We loved it, and they were amazing to us. And and then we won, which was exciting. That's fantastic. Yeah. And did they give you a big award, like a, a, a plate? Or they gave a, us, yeah, like a certificate. Yeah, a certificate's a big. <laughs> yeah. Is it a certificate for you know uh, Macy's or something <laughs> like that? Or? No, it was like they won. You know, here is the proof. That's, That's nice. And what's the, <laughs> yeah. what's the film about then? Well, the film is a much more serious topic, but it's about. A, it follows a soldier who comes home from a tour in Iraq right. um, and about him reintegrating into his life in small town Texas and I play his wife and we just kind of have that that struggle of how hard it difficult it can be for them to reintegrate and and he has sort of symptoms of PTSD and we've been showing the film to, to active duty soldiers right. and um, the response has been intense and amazing and you know it's just a really important issue to did you that we did you do that about. when you were uh, in Iraq did you show the movie to soldiers there not when we were in Iraq no so what did you do there then there we we just we shook their hands and said hi and that, that's <laughs> enough yeah no that, that that well it's you know you could maybe sing a song or something <laughs> next time <laughs> so how's uh, 
the dragon movie that was fun didn't it we we had we had a nice time with that you played astrid the viking <laughs> yeah yeah, yeah. <laughs> i heard about this cup by the way it's Who's like her? legendary it's my penis <laughs> substitute thing <laughs> <laughs> Go on. It looked it looked like a snake to me. I didn't think it, it is. It is a snake. It is a snake. I like it's, your it's, robot, it, by the way. Wait, stop trying to not talk about the snake. Uh, I'm actually I'm in a bit of a huff with him tonight. Why? Oh, I get that way. Uh, <laughs> I have my favorites. <laughs> he's like very, he, he goes, got upgraded. Oh, yeah. Uh, yeah, he does that thing, yeah. <laughs> he's doing it again. Oh, yeah. It's like, oh, it, yeah. yeah, stop it. It's kind of like when really your dog dirty. does something disgusting. It's like that. Oh, yeah. Yeah, knock it off. Knock it off, I'll take you to the vet. <laughs> do you have a dog? Yes. Does it do anything disgusting like that? <laughs> yeah, well, not that. <laughs> I know dogs are like, why, oh, why do we not have opposable thumbs? <laughs> what does your dog do? What kind of a what dog is he it? does he do? He's a dog. Yeah, yeah. Does he, uh, does he work at all? Or? No, he's a golden retriever. He he's, retrieves <laughs> Well, sometimes, yeah. Right. But, you know, not anything useful. Like, you know, he'll, like, eat things he's not supposed to eat. And But he's a good boy. Yeah, does he, uh, does he do disgusting stuff when you have uh, people around? Yeah, he tries to hump a lot of people. That's like, <laughs> that's like that robot. Right? Yeah, exactly like that. That's what Buddy sounds yeah, like. Yeah, that's it. Buddy is the name of your dog? Yeah. Oh, that's nice. It's yeah. not very original, but... No, it's not. <laughs> But that's all right. It's a it's a good kind of solid. You got a dog called Buddy. He's a golden <laughs> exactly. retriever, and exactly. yes, everything's fine then. It's very American. Yeah, it is. So um, <laughs> What's up? we're out of time, actually. <laughs> we Why are? is that funny to you? That's not funny. <laughs> they think their they think their time is up, and they're now free from their. <laughs> so. so there you go. Fancy an awkward pause? <laughs> Oh, um, I don't know what we're supposed to talk about. I did a whole pre-interview no, for no, this. No, 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 no. Oh, it doesn't matter. <laughs> no, we can we can do an awkward pause. We, okay. Yeah, we can do that. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. Don't you clap over our awkward pauses, <laughs> trying to end them. <laughs> That's just funny. What is this? I just like the snake. He's from New Mexico, right? Yeah, Albuquerque. <laughs> Ever been to Albuquerque? We shot, speaking of, our movie in Albuquerque. Really? Yeah. Did you go to the Albuquerque Rattlesnake Museum? No, I did not go to the Albuquerque you Rattlesnake Museum. You wasted your time museum. now, then, didn't you? Because <laughs> you could have got one of these babies. Oh, yeah. I will next time. Yeah, I know. <laughs> well, you kind of made that mug really gross to me, and now... Uh... Because I said the penis thing was only a joke. <laughs> now that's all I see when I look at the rattles. <laughs> <laughs> it's lovely to see you again. We are out of time. Uh, good luck with the movie and winning Thank the award. You. Congratulations. That's Thank lovely. You. The lovely America Ferrera, everybody. <laughs> America for Hello, America. Hello. I never know. Wow. You look great. What a very attractive dress. Thank very you. Very nice indeed. You look attractive. Thank you very much indeed. I might wear this outfit again. <laughs> Do you ever wear things twice? You can't really, can you? Once you wear it, that's it. You're done. Uh, kind of. I try and find reasons to repurpose in my personal life. Oh, all right. So, like, if you, if you wear a dress, like, to a movie premiere, for example, How to Train Your Dragon 2, coming out very soon, <laughs> uh, you can't wear that dress. Or can you wear it again? Would you, like, wear it to a restaurant? I mean, or? I would like to, yes, wear it again. I think that we should all recycle our dresses. Well, I recycle all the time. I wear, I'll be wearing this next Friday. I'll be wearing... 
I swear, I'll be, I wear stuff all the time. Guys have it very easy. Guys, well, it's just suits. It doesn't really matter. Yeah. You know, do you ever watch the fashion police shows and stuff like that and kind of like... No, not on purpose. Every now and then I... <laughs> How does one accidentally watch a television show? You know, you're in a hotel and you're flipping through the channel. Oh, yeah, that's how... Uh, that I used to be my thing when, I, when Larry King was on CNN. I used to always, like, find Larry King. I'd know how things were going. <laughs> anyway, how are you? I haven't seen you for a while, not since the last movie, actually. I know, it's been four years. Yeah, oh, boy. And you grew up in this movie. Well, your character grows up in this movie. You grew up some time ago, and congratulations. Thank you. Um, where are you living now? L.A.? New, New York? York? New York. On the Lower East Side of Manhattan. I, I used to live in the Lower East I know Side. that. Yes, yeah, I love it It was different there. when you were there. Yeah, a little bit. Well, I was there, so it was a little bit of a... <laughs> Do you ever go to Six Street Cycles? No, what is it? Six that? Street Cycles between C and D. Uh, Six Street. My my uh, old friend Hugh runs a cycle repair shop there. If you need to. Uh, <laughs> okay. More, motorcycles, usually British motorcycles, to be honest. So. Oh, okay. <laughs> I don't. Do you live in Alphabet City? Do you live around? No, no, that? I live lower. Like way and downtown. Easter, like Chinatown. Oh wow! Like, yeah. Very funky. up and coming. Yeah, no, it's very good. Yeah. Yeah, I like New York, but they banned ferrets or something, I heard. No, they're now unbanning ferrets. Did you uh, know anything about this? I didn't know ferrets were banned. I didn't know that, no. Yeah, no, I didn't, didn't think of that either. <laughs> so you're on the junket for this film. We got the, we got the junket next week and we got the... Um, I don't know how I'm going to make the junket next Friday because I'm doing a show here, but... <laughs> we need to. Yeah, I don't know how I'm going to do it. I don't know how I'm going to do it. I have to find... The new movie's good, though, right? The movie is wonderful. And, and you grew up in it, and you're Hiccup's girlfriend. Astrid is Hiccup's girlfriend. Well, she's much more than Hiccup's girlfriend. Well, yeah, I know, but you guys are getting it on in the cartoon <laughs> land. We are not getting it on in this movie. Well, no, not in the movie, but the implication is you've <laughs> got it on at some point. I guess that's what would be implied, yeah. Well, yeah, it's kind of like that's what I took from Your it. Your character right? in this film has some um, personal That's some big revelation. news. Yeah, 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 yeah. He comes out. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> No, it was really fun. What happened was we were ad-libbing in the... Because you ad-lib when we do the voices, right? You kind like, mess yeah. around with the script and yeah. add little bits. So I had a line where I was watching two people arguing, and I said to Hiccup, to Jay's character, see, this is why I never married. And then I ad-libbed the line, just threw it in, and one other reason. <laughs> and, and then Dean said, I, I think that's a good idea. And so they left it in, and he comes... It, it's not that he comes out. It, he sort of comes out. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> It's true. Yeah, I think that's all right. It's cool. Yeah, you know. a lot of deep moments in the film. Yeah. <laughs> it's, it's a bit darker, this one, actually. It, isn't is, it? Yeah, it is. But a... I think kids like that. I always liked really dark stuff when I was a kid. What did you watch when you were a kid, then? Did you watch uh, Labyrinth and all that kind of stuff? Um, no, but you know the one movie I can remember like made me not be able to sleep for years was Ghost. <laughs> Where, you know? <laughs> you, watched, you watched Ghost as a kid? Yeah, I was really young. Even the pottery thing with the... <laughs> <laughs> well, that wasn't the scariest part for me. The scariest part was when the bad guy dies and then the demons come yeah. out of hell and drag him back. I couldn't sleep for literally... Years. I'm still trying to. to, to so you don't sleep. Let's get a bit of therapy going on then. Are you? Are you in? Uh, are you in therapy? I am. Yeah. Really? Well. Yeah. So you're frightened of the demons from hell coming to get you, but surely, I, from what I know about you, your behaviour is very respectable. You, well, you no don't demons. know very much about me. I don't know very much. <laughs> I think if, you know, if you were a demon candidate, I would have heard on the show business grapevine. So and all, you, I, all I hear about you is you're a happily married woman, you get on with your life, you do your stuff, very professional, nice dress, you usually wear them more than once, meow. Uh, <laughs> <sighs> so, yeah. Uh, mm. Have you ever smoked? Smoked what? <laughs> Well, you raise an interesting question. Um, how do you relax? <laughs> um, I walk my dog. Oh, that's all right. What kind of dog you got? A golden retriever. I like golden retrievers, although they're, and I mean no disrespect here, they're not the sharpest tacks in the... Uh, oh, come on. Oh, uh, they're a little bit... 
you know, could have. <laughs> <laughs> um, you look, little, little you looked a little bit like my dog. Well, yeah. <laughs> you know. Old, young, a young golden retriever? He's a, not young. Do you have an old golden retriever? Yeah. Your apartment must smell terrible. No, it doesn't. <laughs> Was that all right? Everything's yeah. still, you know? With the apartment? Yeah, you know, with the dog's with poopy bit. With the business. dog. Yeah. Oh, yeah, everything's fine with the poop. All right, okay. Good. How's that? No, you no. still have your snake uh, mug. Yeah, yeah. Well, why, why wouldn't I? I Would I replace it with a golden <laughs> retriever mug? Well, four years ago, I commented on how I liked your snake, and you took that uh, to mean something. You took that to mean something else. Well, you know, a man can dream. <laughs> Uh, no, it's uh, it's a thing. It's kind of you know. I guess there's uh, some Freudian significance. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, we're out of time. How do you want to finish this up? Awkward pause. Uh, mouth organ. <laughs> you want to uh, do a uh, dance with a horse? The horse wasn't here last time. I'd like to do a dance with the horse. Yeah. Well, I'm sure we could arrange it. Uh, okay. <laughs> I took my ferrets to see the chipmunk movie today. You got a picture of that? There you are. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> there was nobody else in the movie theater as well. <laughs>